four down. On to game number five, and that's where we find ourselves tonight for this playoff series. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Welcome. Well, we've been waiting for this one all day long, and here we go. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Stop that one. Howe's got it across the line. Keeps hold of the puck. with about as perfect a road start you can get here, Ray. They came out and wanted to be aggressive, sure, but you never really think you're going to get on the board this quickly. Ajo's won the draw inside the neutral zone. And that one's turned away. And here's the pass to Marner. Team Canada's going to play it from the corner. Backhander. High. I like the way they've gone about this game. They kept working away, not taking too many chances, and their work has resulted in a tie game. Two parts to this, James. He gets himself into the low slot in good position, and then he zips a backhander past the tender. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. It's all tied up. Carolina's won the draw. Pushes it across to Svechnikov. Moves oh, it the end to Pronger. Here's a chance, and he makes the save. The Hurricanes have it against the wall. Big stop by the keeper. And it's a quick pass to Huberto. Cuts to the front. Big time stop by Anderson. That's a really good save. I think the goalie's probably surprised he was dead center and open to shoot that puck. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Tara Bynan. Sends the pass in front, and that's stopped. On the back end, denies him again. Oh, he followed the puck really well there. A couple of good stops. Moves it around along the half wall. Good hit on the play. And a little body contact on that play. Slides it quickly to Shanahan. Takes the pass, and that's broken out. Scooped up along the wall by Slavin. Can't make it work. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Canada's got it against the boards. Go oh, after being on the receiving end of that hit, James. No surprise. He's heading slowly to the bench. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Dishes it to Slavin. Moves the puck along the half wall. Team Canada's got control of it now from their own end. A chance in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Sips inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Team Canada's gained possession along the boards. Canada's got it along the wall. An easy save by Anderson. More than half the frame has been played here. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Shifley's got the puck, and they'll go on the attack. Hammers the shot. Denies him. He got all of it. Getting a little physical there with that collision. There's a solid collision. Slides it over to Shifley. Pass broken up. Takes the feed at center for the right wing. Cuts to the paint. Anderson's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Centers glide into the dot as a face-off ready to resume play. Team Canada's won the face-off. Shabbat's got it against the boards. Quick pass to Marner. The transition game now into full effect as they move across the blue line. 
Team Canada's moving it along the wing. With possession along the wall. Here he is on the backhand. And he makes the save on that play. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. Big open ice hit. Was it ever. He really closed off the room. Nowhere to go. Sends it over to Huberto. Moves it to Shabbat. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Looks to make a play over to Ajo. Pass across to Howe. And a bad pass, and they'll be forced to start all over again outside the offensive end. Now a quick pass to Ajo. Gains the zone. From the backhand in front. Turned aside by Anderson. There's the horn to conclude period number one, and Ray Ferraro's already off to grab his intermission hot dog. We'll be back in just a moment. second intermission you'd love at least a couple goal lead going into period three face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway carolina's looking to break out of their own end here's a short pass to svechnikov puck grabbed by riley poked away in the neutral zone by burns moves it over to shanahan Team Canada's got the puck along the wall. Skates across the blue line. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. Moves it quickly over to Shanahan. Makes a move in front. Whoa. It scores. Now, this is a different level here. You get into your first playoffs, and you're able to get on the board. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Shifley's gained possession inside the neutral zone. Can't make the connection on the pass. Great feed from the left side. A chance in front. Pick up some momentum again here as a face-off is ready to go. Nietzsche takes possession right off the draw. Slavin's going to hear it from the crowd for the rest of the night. He caused that er earlier injury to the home team player, and they're not very happy with him. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the chompers on that play. Let's move to the middle. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Slides the puck ahead to Bergeron. Carolina's got the puck. Carries it into the offensive end up the middle. And he takes the feed. McDavid's going to play it against the half wall. Passes it in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Okay. The Frogger's got a great defense. 
offensive game, guys. A big part of that is his stick-em-up zone ability, which is his proficient stick-checking in his own zone. He's known to be a responsible player, and you know his coaches put a lot of trust in him because of it. Feeds it to Brindamore. Shot gets in the lane with the body. Pass to McDavid. On the attack along the boards. Great reach with the poke check by Primo. The Hurricanes move it in. And a good solid hit on that play. Slides the puck across to Shabbat. Quick pass to McDavid. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Here's a shot and makes a save. Directs it on over to Crosby. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Anderson's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around. It's the shift they wrong. This helps. In the final moments of this period, we are all tied up in this one. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Team Canada's got possession at center. From the right side, takes the pass. Moves it to Stone. And that's intercepted by Coffey. Handles the pass. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Canada's working the transition through the middle of the ice. And that's poked away by Pesci. Canada's got the puck along the wall. Sensational stop with the stick by Anderson. Read of the play was perfect, but it's his quickness that gets out tight to the puck. So the shooter can't elevate it anywhere. There's nowhere for the puck to go. Quick feed to O'Reilly. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Steps across the blue line. Canada's got a hold of it against the wall. Team Canada's in transition. That brings the period to an end. Ray and Carlin both off to get some poutine from the concessions. I'm gonna grab some popcorn and we're coming back with period number three in moments. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Great wheels. He gets outside and gets a lane to the net. You're not slowing him down. Good save by the goalie at the end of the play. Both teams lining up for the face-off, and it's a chance to see if there's actually some power in this power play. If you can find a way to get a power play goal here, you can change the momentum of this game. They haven't got one yet tonight. And you find yourself starting to press when you don't score. Slick feed. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's a short pass to Marchand. They move the puck out of harm's way. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Takes the feed. Carolina's got it in their own zone. Gets it out of his own end. Picked up along the wall by Marchand. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Team Canada's got the puck in the corner. Moves it quickly over to Petrangelo. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Canada's got a hold of the puck now. Grabbed along the boards by Petrangelo. Cut into the front of the net. Big time hit on the play. Petrangelo's got the puck in his own zone. Great reach with the hook check. here on this power play. Sends one up to Huberto. Kroger's up at the box. Oh, that's a huge stop by Anderson. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Bergeron's got it in the defensive end. Tosses it to Crosby. Canada's on the attack. The Hurricanes gain control of the puck. 
And he slides it quickly to Natchez. There's another for the hit parade. Skate save! Oh, and it's another save on the play. Really sharp, never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Oh, gets a blocker on it to turn it away. Made that stop. Moves it to the offensive zone. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Goaltender covers up and will get a faceoff. More than half the period left to play. We got a tie game. Back underway as he wins the try inside the offensive zone. Lays into the body on the play. Anderson's got the puck. Boy, he's been under fire tonight. Been really sharp, and in a close game, you can't make a mistake that costs a critical goal. And the centers glide towards the dot here as we got a face-off set to go. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Carolina's through center and now in the offensive end. And now it's grabbed by Brown. Let's get the call. He came from so far across the rink, and he never slowed up. If he glides the last 10 feet, he's probably okay. unit guys he's got that zone ability and it could really be the key to get things going here and give them the advantage Couturier's won the draw in his own end now let's see if they can clear it puck sent over to Ajo quick pass to Svechnikov moves it to the middle and he'll hang on to it to regroup here for a moment sends the pass over turns him away and we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Nietzsche's will look to win possession here on the faceoff and try to continue this power play on the right note. Team Canada's got possession here in their own end. And now he passes up to O'Reilly. Looking to make something happen along the board. Oh, they're gonna go! Yeah, but they look... James, of course someone's stepping in for him. They're not gonna let him fight. The crushing blow to finish it. Uh, sometimes you're just too big or too strong for the guy you line up against, and that one ended like it should have. Now that their dust-up is over, they can go to the box, grab some water, and try and catch their breath. I'm always amazed at how tired these guys are after their fights. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. Nietzsche has won the draw inside his own end. The Hurricanes pick up steam and are on the attack. Backhander in front. Denies him! Canada's got it along the wall. And that's a smart heads-up play by Coffey. Poked away at center by McCarr. Canada's got the puck now. Eflad stick handling in his own zone. Moves into the slot. Big time save by Anderson. And now he moves it quickly to Eflad. And that's a great heads up play by Natchez. Team Canada's got it in their own zone. And that pass doesn't go. Slides it over with pace to Tara Biden. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Tremendous save by Fleury. Good stand-up hit on the play. Team Canada's PK unit gets their man out of the box. Oh, I really like the penalty kill there. They were on the same page almost all over the ice that entire power play. The game stays tied because of their fine work. And he regains control of the puck. Carolina's got possession of the puck. And he takes the pass. Moves it to Pronger. Stays with it. Carolina's got a hold of this along the wall. Oh, that's a big time save. I think he got it with a toe. The run by plays are just that. So quick. Puck on the stick. Puck off the stick. The goalie's got to be in the right position or they're not going to make that quick save. 
tries to feed it over to Howe. Piece of a choke with that hit. Into the corner now. Oh, did the rink rattle after that collision in the corner? The Hurricanes looking against the half wall. He scores! And the deadlock's been broken. Now you get a chance to control the pace of the game. It's tough to do it in a tie game. Now you've got the lead. Carolina's gone up by one. What's the strategy now, Ray? Nothing really changes except you were, you're cognizant of the fact you have a one-goal cushion. But you want to play up the ice. You want to be aggressive. Puck is trapped, and we are back underway. Driving right to the front! in the net just a few seconds later. Team Canada's gone up by one in this third period. Do you attack or do you sit back? Well, for me, it's always to attack. At least don't be conservative yet. Too much time left. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Moves inside! stages of this period. Team Canada's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Carolina's won it. Sends a pass over. Quick feed to Pacioretty. Stones him with the blocker. Tees him up. Stops him with the glove. No, oh, he's on it there. Both saves are really good ones. Goes right to the crease. Huberto's on the attack in the offensive zone. Approaching the final minute of regulation. He got all of that hit on the play. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Dumps it in. Picked up along the boards by Primo. Oh, he's got it in the offensive zone. Carolina's emptied the net, the extra, and into the empty net. That should probably go here. I would think so, James. I mean, this turned out to be a pretty good hockey game, but once the empty net are hit, that seems to seal the deal. The centers will glide into the dive. Puck is shot, play resumes. Puck clears the zone, and they'll be forced to regroup. Here's a short pass to Ajo, and he keeps that one out as he gets a piece of the glove. Oh, and another big stop. That's some good goaltending right there. That puck comes out. He scores! What a goal! wins it. Moves it quickly over to Brad. Fires it! Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece 